It's after 7 o'clock, back to school day for many, but not all. Classes are canceled today up in Muncie. The district is saying that the day is being used to try to fix big problems that popped up yesterday with its school bus system. Yesterday was day one. 24 hour news says Tomo Lillo is live in Muncie right now with what we know. Good morning. Yeah, good morning to you both. What we've learned at this point is it's a transportation issue with the buses. Yesterday morning, some buses were more than an hour late to pick up kids. Some kids on the south side didn't even get picked up. The issues continued after school as well. One parent told us that her son didn't get home till about 6 o'clock tonight. High school, not surprisingly, uh, closed and nobody's around. And we've been driving around for about an hour now just trying to see if we could talk to parents or students that maybe have the day off today. Haven't been able to find anybody yet, but uh, we also talked to the superintendent of the, about the bus problems, and he said that there's always kinks to work out on the first day. He says they're redistrict, redistricting after the closure uh, of three different schools uh, as part of that deficit reduction plan added to the confusion yesterday for their new transportation company. Parents obviously upset about what happened with their kids. Some say they didn't get home till the late afternoon. Parents we talked to described a hectic and scary situation. I had no idea where my seven-year-old was for three hours this afternoon. Not acceptable at all. But my daughter's seven. I really should be able to put her on the bus and say a prayer that everybody's safe and she gets to school and it's not like that at all. This is, It's a mess. It's not like this was total chaos in Meltdown. The vast majority of the kids got on our buses and got to school safely and are getting home safely. Yeah, unclear at this point how many kids didn't get picked up or how many kids were really affected by this. We did know about 20 students at Southside Middle School were impacted. And in a statement from the school corporation, leaders apologize for any inconvenience for families. We should have an update around 3 o'clock today. That's what time the school district says they'll be updating parents. Now, in terms of where these kids are or what parents are doing, at least some of the people I talked to, we're at a donut shop right across from the high school. Word is that this place gets pretty busy right around now, but that's because high school is usually open at this time, but uh, not really anybody here at this point. We're still trying to see if parents are kind of just dropping kids off with family members. Uh, YMCA says they haven't been getting a lot of calls, so kind of just a day off for kids in the middle of the summer. You know, like a snow day on second day of school right. almost. Right. Who and have this, of course, is happening in a district that has had a lot of trouble. Finances are under the control of a state-appointed emergency management team. Yeah, so the team 